Hello guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we are at CC Farms and um, I'm going to give you guys a tour of my garden. Alright, so let's get into it. So here we are. Now, <clears throat> we, I was unable to record this because um, I didn't really know how to edit up until now. And um, I was just unable to record it. It was too cold. It was rainy. And uh, so I'm making a video about it now. All right, so I'm gonna show you everything that we have planted and for some of these things, we might have to get replacements. Um, because, unfortunately, here in Tennessee, it has gotten quite cold the past few nights. And, um, if you look at this one right here. You see that its leaves are wilted and they're, like, yellow. Um, sorry about that. Um, but they're wilted and yellow. And white, white and yellow. That is because of frostbite. Luckily, not many others have had that. And, uh, this one, it kind of, kind of has. But hopefully... It will just perk up again and it's not supposed to get too cold again so uh, hopefully they still live um, also this is just some pine needles yeah pull those up or a branch there all right so <clears throat> I am going to tell you what all I have in my garden all right, so here we have some cucumbers. We have um, six cucumbers, two of them, these two, that one and that, this one, um, are the bush pickle cucumber. And uh, over here, uh, this one kind of got wilted. I just hope they perk up again. I'm not exactly sure if they will, but I hope they I hope they do. Um, so we have one there. Um, and then let me find it. So one here. And then oh, that's not good. We have one here. Looks like it got too frostbit. That's kind of disappointing, but, oh, there's another one, so the same thing, but it looks like everything is going good, um, this one, it didn't really get affected by it, it's, um, a pickling, those ones that I just saw you, uh, sorry, that I just, um, shown you were those pickling cucumbers. Um, and then right here, oh, it looks like we have another, hmm, that's not good. So, these right here are, um, those two with the leaves. Now, those two, I'm I'm wondering whether or not a rabbit got a hold of them. Because our fence, well, there is chicken wire on the bottom here, as you can see. But I think a rabbit might could have gotten through, or maybe even a bird, because we have many birds. 
But those are green bell peppers. That one survived. And this one got ate up or something. But then we have um, a Golden California Wonder sweet pepper. And we have uh, a Red Knight sweet pepper. And then we have about 10 tomatoes. And uh, so we have a German Johnson, a Sun Sugar. So this one right here is a Tommy Toe. And this one is supposed to get big. This one is a big one. We've already got a tomato cage around it. And then I have two marigolds planted here. And uh, I have a mountain merit tomato, which I'm glad these haven't been affected by the weather. Another sun sugar and a Carolina gold, if you can see that there. And then I have three rows here of sweet corn. Yep, three rows. One here, one here, and one here. And then a walkway in the middle. And uh, down here, I have a zucchini zucchini squash i have four of those and then i have two straight neck yellow straight neck squash <clears throat> so that's my garden so far and hopefully things will get better and i'll make sure to have another um update um on this on the garden here and uh in my next video i will do an update on the chickens so hopefully you stick around till the end of the video uh well one last thing before i go uh don't forget to like and subscribe and uh ring the bell below and comment your favorite video so far Peace.